All right, I've got another sketchbook tour. This one, the sketchbook started in January 2019. And we started out with an autonomous sketch. Read his book and saw the movie Free Solo, which was awesome. Check it out if you have it on a big screen. And, uh, and then some character sketches from either books or pop culture. Now on this side, most of the time I'll have light sketches. This sketchbook has really thin paper. I got it because it's a, a larger size, but the thin paper made it tricky to, uh, to draw on both sides. So most of the time I just sketched on, on this side and then did a lot of practices on the left here. And then some more characters here, Brene Brown, Russell Nelson, uh, way before I became president of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. Some warm-ups here. Ellie Kemper, read her book. She talked about playing field hockey. There's a lot of sketches through here uh, trying to figure out Michael Jordan's uh, likeness. It's a really difficult one uh, for me to, to capture for some reason. Andre Agassi here on the right. Some Michael Jordan. And Dan Reynolds from Imagine Dragons. A figure study on the left. On the right here, this was an opportunity that I had to uh, design a character for a, an illustration for a t-shirt for a person that makes long boards and this person has one one hand but he's a, a great carpenter and anyway I exchanged this uh, design and illustration for uh, a long custom long board which is pretty awesome. This is us. Great show. And I'll have several versions of conference sketches here. This one is from April 2019. And uh, just on one side, and those will grow over time, you'll see. Mark Rover. Sketch depicting uh, Henry Higgins and Eliza Doolittle from My Fair Lady. We've got some Spider Man gesture practice. And a relative of mine. Billy Crystal, Sally Field. Gesture figure sketches. Got the singer Sissel right here, Leonardo da Vinci. In Houston. And the practice of uh, Donovan Mitchell. One of the things that is evident in this sketchbook is um, some of these uh, were practices for characters that I did um, videos for for the YouTube channel. Sometimes I'll practice and then uh, record the, the digital sketch as the Manuel Miranda in the style of Al Hirschfeld. And finally, uh, uh, the likeness of Michael Jordan and the, the gesture that I liked. I put that one together for the sketch video process drawing. It's on YouTube, you can watch that. Bridget W. Bush, a friend of mine who authored her own book. Honor. Grew up here in Utah. And then again, more dedicated time for these general conference sketches. General conference happens in April and October every year. And uh, these are the First Presidency and the Twelve Apostles. And the 
false peak. And I've done many of these, started when I was singing in the Tabernacle Choir. It's always fun to go back and look at those. There's Mr. Rogers here. This one here, love that, that look there, so if you were in, probably. Eliud, Eliud Kipchoge, that was right after he broke the two hour mark for a full marathon. Amazing. And just some recent sketches actually as I've gone through this to fill in all the blank pages. One direction. Carnacion from Nacho Libre. Some LeBron James there. And these sketches are fun. This is a project that I worked on for uh, Weber State University for a card. I did the illustrations and a friend of mine did all of the motion. So kind of just had to create this and then we rigged it so that it could move a little bit. University would pick that up as kind of a new character. So I'm gonna phone calls. Maybe one day. Some practices for, uh, looks like those are all thumbnails for that same project. Ken Jennings, here's my friend. He's actually a videographer that uh, I worked with on that Weber State project, Isaac, and his wife, Becca. Crossfitters. Rogers and Hammerstein. Now this is a great picture. Nadine Wimmer is a news anchor here locally in Utah. I did this character of her uh, mostly because, uh, and this is a long story I won't get into, I was able to get an autographed headshot of her through work, which was kind of based on a, a joke. Anyway, once I got it, which I, I wasn't expecting, uh, I did this character of Nadine, and then within this frame, I, I put a character of myself and, and posted on social media and tagged her so, and she eventually did see it and liked it. It was pretty, pretty funny to hear a response from her. This is folks from Del Mistress. And Emily. Some more Michael Jordan. Told you there's a lot. There's me getting Simps Simpsonified, is that a word? Kind of drawing my wife and I in the style of the Simpsons. Not oh, really flattering prior I guess. My drag scene Stiffy Graph. Some boys. And I was working on this project, just a sketch of my wife and I for our anniversary. Just, I could not make that work. Never, never did. Not sure why. Some practice with Fred Rogers. Sister in law Tammy, an opera singer. Sketch that takes up the entire spread. April 2020. So the first general conference that we had during the pandemic. That's where the sketches. Michael Jordan, he's all through this thing. Uh, this spread is mostly Carl Malone. Uh, one of his iconic kind of poses. I was able to make that work with this character of him. I like how it turned out. It was a lot of fun to do that. Indiana Jones. of all the characters of Clue. Great, great show. Hard 
casters. Charlie from Lost. Here's some sketching that I did of a, a map that I, I created. Uh, it was based on some stories from my personal history, which is fun. Sketching practice for fellows at Dude Perfect. This was a project that was a lot of fun too, the garbage to tell kids. My kids wanted to create their own business over the summer and uh, cleaning garbage cans. So I uh, helped them put together a little name for their business, the Garbage Detail Kids, and uh, created some really fun cards just like the Garbage Pail Kids. Charlie Bird. Mascot. And some faces. I was really studying faces of people and having them enjoy popsicles because I was really over the summer of 2020 uh, making popsicles quite a bit and uh, wanting to brand kind of a popsicle operation called the Pineapple Hut. And these were a bunch of sketches I had, cartoony sketches of these kind of uh, women um, as uh, spokesmodels, I guess, imaginary spokesmodels. Faces. Looks like we got a Larry Bird in there somewhere. Okay, just practicing different poses, gestures. Other other artists were Halle Berry is uh, done the style of. A famous character artist, Tom Richmond. And he's practicing some of the greats from over the years in their style. Tens. Now here is a uh, this. You can see this uh, conference sketch. All of the people on this page are kind of facing this way, and all the people facing this way, uh, as if they're talking uh, to the, you know, everyone in every corner of the world. And then, of course, in the middle here, you've got a Krista statue. If you can see that, kind of in the gutter of the of the book. That's a lot of fun putting that one together. Let's see, they just keep evolving. Uh, these were some practice sketches for uh, another sketch video that I did. And this one ended up upside down, but uh, this is uh, a character that I did, Tia Carrere, as the character Cassandra from Wayne's World. So there she is. That was a fun, fun video to put together. There's an old Carmelone character pose that I uh, Done. Anthony Sweat, another great artist, religious professor down at BYU. And Louis Anderson, this, this character was inspired by watching the show Baskets. If you haven't seen Baskets with Zach Galifianakis, Louis Anderson plays the mother. It's hilarious. Alex Trebek. Got us the duo right here. Great singing group. Iceman, Top Gun. And we've got Marianne from Gilligan's Island. She died not too long ago. That's when, that's when I drew that picture. And then we've got some concepting for my Happy to Be 43 birthday brand of the year. Scott Adams character of him after I read his book. He's the uh, illustrator and uh, author by Gilbert. Other podcasters. There's a 
project I work on for the neighbor line, this company. My figure drawings. And Jerry Seinfeld. Bill Marriott. And then I did a series of sketches uh, based on some experiences from my time in Ica, Peru, where I served my mission. I did a, a witch, a mermaid, and a princess of their wine festival. All having to do with that town. The witch right there, La Bruja de Cachiche. Here's some friends, Andrea and her husband got married. Some wonderful friends from Peru. C.S. Lewis, she reading the screw tape letters and drew that. And then I was designing a bike poster, so I explored lots of different poses and ideas for bike poster. Here's another conference sketch done. This one is done around the Syracuse Temple. Syracuse Temple was announced not too long ago. Um, probably in October of 2020 is when it was announced and so this sketch uh, they had released the art for the Syracuse Temple and so I put it right in the middle and then once again I've got these characters mostly looking out. These out the other direction. The presence of the Corman full of fossils. We have the big poppy. Famous baseball player for the Red Sox. Pages of just random figures and sketches. Gentry, and uh, they go around touring, singing, and uh, we went to see them all perform in Lynn's Rob at the Health Center Theater, which is, I guess, we met doing that years ago. It was kind of cool to see them. Amazing, amazing performance. These characters are uh, people we met in Hawaii, and people that really made our trip pretty awesome. They all that sold us cookies. Got our tour guide, hiked us through the rainforest. We got our crazy waiter who kind of made a bad impression at first, but then was pretty awesome. Guy at the towel stand at the pool. Here's our surf instructor. And even the guy that did surfing lessons with us. Wilson, now playing for the New York Jets, where she just went out with an injury, which is too bad. And then these are just a bunch of little tiny uh, logos slash icons that I put together for um, a book of memories of uh, our trip to Hawaii that my wife and I were able to take. And there's some uh, letterscape concepts and scribbles was able to work on this last year. Chip and Joanna Gaines. Faces, faces, some practice doing Ted Lasso. Some figures. Shohei Otani, amazing hitter and pitcher for the California Angels. Some Dolly Parton, she's another one, but just so, it's so funny because her look is so distinct, but I couldn't capture her likeness. Um, you know, her look has got pretty extreme the older she's gotten, and I, I don't think that it's very uh, flattering to, to draw someone not looking super pretty, and so I tried to just catch her when she was younger and try my best.
Richard Slater, an author, Brad Wilcox, one of my favorite authors. This uh, couple from uh, Schmigadoon, which I love, love, love that musical. Super happy that I was able to discover it. And some most recent sketches. What would happen if Wendy's became Wendy's? Look at her logo. That restaurant logo as if the wind was blowing against it. Rita Moreno, who uh, essentially was the first person to say, hey, you guys, on the electric company. And then it was probably made more, uh, made famous also by Sloth from the Goonies. Here we've got the most recent conference sketch. This one has got some allusion to Crown Burger. Uh, I told the story about preparing for conference, just like the people over at Crown Burger prepared for uh, a massive amount of people coming to their restaurant after a priesthood session. So you've got onion rings in the middle, and then just all around this little things from Crown Burger. In the very, very middle, that's a depiction of the Liahona, which is uh, of a story from the Book of Mormon. There's Sloth at the top there, and then we've got our characters from the monster cereals. We have Chocula, Frankenberry, and Booberry. Just wrapping up here, here's some light sketches, some Halloween characters, and then we've got some Ghostbusters uh, that I drew kind of put the intention to swap them out for Snap, crack, snap, Crackle, and Pop on a Rice Krispies box and named it Rice Creepies. And now we've got a quick little Snap, Crackle, and Pop study. And I took them from their Rice Krispies box and made them Snap, Crackle, and Papa John's, put them on a pizza box. Give them your job. Anyway, that's it. That's been a fun one. Took me a long time to finish that one, but uh, Glad to move on to the next one. Thanks for joining.